tutorial we're going to learn how to export our final scene to a .mov and this works for Harmony Essentials, Advanced, and Premium. So we can see here we've got our full scene. It goes all the way to 120 frames. And if I go ahead and play it, we've got our frame-by-frame -frame paperless animation, our cutout puppet, our multi-planning bush and background, the camera's doing a pan to the side and a zoom in, and we've also got a blur effect on this bush, although we cannot see it in this current view. So all this going on, we're going to go ahead and go up to File, Export, and Movie. And we're going to go into Browse. I'm going to choose my desktop. And I'm going to call this Mountain Top Hike. I'm going to go ahead and call this Mountain Top Hike 3 for me. And I'm going to go ahead and hit Save. And in my export range, I can choose to export all my frames, or I can choose a range of frames. I'm going to go ahead and leave it at all, because I want all 120 frames. For resolution, I'm going to keep my resolution the way it is, which is the scene's resolution, 1920 by 1080. In the options, I'm going to go into the movie options, and this is basically where you can control what gets rendered out. In this case, I want the video, but I don't want sound or prepare for preparing for internet stream. I don't need those. In the settings, I can go into that, and I can control the compression and how well it uh, renders out. I'm going to go ahead and have all the keyframes there. I'm going to keep it at the animation compression, and I'm going to have the quality be best quality. So I'm going to hit OK here and OK here, and I'm all set, and I can hit OK here. And I'm going to actually go ahead and hit Cancel because I've already rendered this out. So I'm going to go back to my desktop, and I've got my QuickTime right here. I'm going to set it to the screen size, and if I scroll through, I can see that my animation is all here. I've got my multi-planning, my zoom in, and all my pieces are working together. If I play it, it might be a little choppy. A little bit choppy. That's on my computer, of course. But as you can see, the entire frame, the entire scene is there. I can go to my uh, frame number down here for the QuickTime program, and I can see that it's got all 120 frames. And that is how you render your final movie out of Harmony.